Oh, save. Oh, wow. Upsets back on. Go on, man. Let's go over one. Right, hello everyone and welcome to this new video on the channel. So today is Tuesday the 21st November 2023 and today we have got game number 43 of the 23-24 season on the channel. We're heading back to Oxford Street for Rosenton, Maine versus Worksop Town in the Sheffield and Hallamshire Cup round number three. So in today's video we've got my thoughts pre-halftime and post-match as well as the match day vlog itself. So without further ado, let's get into the video. So let's start with the home team and my team at Rosenton Mains. So they are currently in ninth place out of 20 teams in the Northern Counties East League Premier Division, which is step five of non-league. Had a pretty decent season for first season at this level. Uh, the last result was on the Saturday where they won at home by four goals to two against Tagcaster Albion. Uh, so that's ended a three-game streak without a win. Um, it's been quite inconsistent form to fair. They have had a good season, but... The form has been quite inconsistent. Um, but I suppose the good thing about that is they've not, like I say, they've not won many games in a row, but they've also not lost many games in a row. So they've not got in, into any bad runs of form as such. It seems to be kind of a case of one win, one loss, or a win, a draw, a loss, or, you know, a mixture of results all in one. No real pattern to the results and no real streaks to the results either. But nevertheless, a pretty solid first season so far in step five and that's a works up town as well they have also been promoted up a step uh, they have been at this step before so they are currently at step three of non-league in the northern premier league premier division and they're doing pretty well they're sitting in third place at the moment in a playoff spot uh, however they did lose the last game which was a 2-1 away loss to warrington rylands um, so that's ended a three game winning streak for him and in them three games of one, we actually scored 16 goals in them three games. So a pretty hefty amount of goals at the minute. The second highest scorers in the league currently behind the lead leaguers, Radcliffe. Um, so like I say, they came up last season, won the Northern Premier League East Division last year. Only losing one game all season, which was actually... The first game of the season, where they lost to second place uh, Stockton Town. Um, and then, like I say, after that, they didn't lose another game all season, breaking all sorts of records and, of course, getting promoted. So, obviously, these haven't been in the same league um, as each other. However, they did play in a pre-season friendly last season, which I don't really want to be reminded of, and hopefully it's not going to be anywhere near that result this time. Rosso lost 9-0 to Worksop at Worksop uh, for a 7-0 down at half time it kind of did look a bit like men versus boys to be fair but it was a pre-season friendly and a lot of young uns um, and obviously works up a class outfit so that brings me on to today then so both teams are a league high this time so which team do i think are going to advance to the quarter final of the sheffield and hallamshire cup my prediction is I hope this isn't true, but I just think Worksop's going to be too strong for Rosso. I think we're going to have too much. I don't think it's going to be 9-0, but I think we are going to dominate this game. I'm going to go for Rosenton main nil, Worksop Town 3. Anyway, they are my thoughts before the match then, so let's head on back to Oxford Street and see how today's game goes. <laughs> Just 
Go on. Oh. And again. It's a good ball, that. Get it stored back for overs. Good ball. Go on. Go on. Ah. Again. About a month ago. Get to him. Money. Oh, you got pace. Go on. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh, it's offside anyway, but oh, nice. Go on. Oh, probably like last chance for half time, I'd say. All right, well, no, no half time. So half time, it's Rosa to main nil at Worksop Town nil, and Rosa are playing quite well here. To be fair, they're really pushing Worksop because Worksop do look a class side. But um, Rosa are, like I say, we're defending really well, but keeping them to minimal chances, not really many clear cut chances, and they're creating some of their own. To be fair, like I say, Manny is having a really good game, bringing the ball forward. It's just that final pass, like I say, when we've ran the ball forward, just making that final ball through that they're missing, but. Apart from that, yeah, it's looking really impressive from Rosso. And Worksop, like I say, they look a good team, but they're not really creating it. They're, you can tell they've got class, though. I mean, it's you know, it's how long Rosso can keep us at base with fair because you can kind of tell Worksop are going to get into this game, but it's just a matter of when. But Rosso are doing well so far, so hopefully they can keep them at bay like they have been doing. So anyway, let's get into the second half and see if that's the case. <laughs> Go on. Yes. yes! Get in. Great, son. Aye. Get in. Join up, sound cards. Good ball. Oh, oh. oh. Okay. Oh, yeah. Get in. Cup sets back on. Go on, man. <laughs> oh, save. Oh, wow, save. What a double save. Ah, cheap. Fucking shite! 
Come on, get the air on me. <laughs> Shit. Shit. Okay. Good hands again. Go on. Get up. Go on. Go on. Ah, that's sad. Anyway. Oh. Keep him there. Oh, do. Oh, it's all. Oh. He's getting it off. That's full time. I was going to say. Big centre back. Got pen on it. Cut and tail. Get it. Two two. Here we go. He's looked good all game. Swarm to win it then. <coughs> Let's go over one. Get in! Get in! Come on! Rosso's still in it. Ooh. Take it to sudden death. Get in! So Neff is. Shit. Works off a fruit. Yeah. So at full time it's finished. Rosen to main two at Worksop Town. Two with Worksop winning by four goals three on penalties. And that's pretty good to be fair. I mean I mean Worksop looked the class team. They looked they looked good and they really turned up in the second half, you can tell. Especially when Rosa went one a lot, they really picked the intensity up and went for it. But um Rosso looked good. They really looked good and were unlucky not to get some out of this game because, like I say, Worksop were the better team, but they didn't have too many big chances. Um, like I say, they were definitely the stronger team and played a lot better, but Rosso defended for their lives. And like I say, when Manny got the brought ball and hit him on the break, um, you know, it was superb. And then, obviously, you get to penalties, anything can happen. And I'm really good for Manny because he really has played superb. He's been my man of the match tonight. Um... And I think a few others have had a really good game. Harry Shepard at... Um, I'm trying to think what side we're on now. Uh, left back, about it. Sorry, left back. I thought he were. That's the best I've seen him play. And they're just like... Works up and no mugs there. You can tell, you know, why they're... That, you know, two leagues above. And Rosso stuck in there with him. And, you know, deserve all the credit in the world, really. Because they really have give Works up a good game here. And... Um, 
you know, we've not gone through to the quarterfinals, but we can certainly be proud of that performance. Commiserations to Rosso and congratulations to Workshop. It'll be interesting to see if they can go all the way, which they won two years ago. So be interesting to see if I can do that again this year. Um, like I say, we're in the quarterfinals now, and Rosso are left to focus on the league. Um, although I think we've still got the NCL Cup to go as well, but other than that, like I say, just for league for Rosso. But I'm going to leave this video here anyway. Thank you very much for watching. We are so close to a thousand subs now, it is just inches away. So, like I say, if you could please like and subscribe. Get me to a thousand before the end of the year, that would be absolutely superb and would mean a lot. So, the next video you'll see will actually be tomorrow. We've got Retford United against Armed Fort Welfare. So, until then, thanks a lot for watching. Take care, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.